Now this is the ESC that burned up right near the end. Um, the flight time was about four minutes and like 57 or 58 seconds. Um, I'm going to test the batteries right now. I'm going to go get my tester so we'll see how much power we have left. Okay now after that flight uh, of about 
five minutes, just short of five minutes. Um, we still have 22.7 is still left in the battery on the one side for, on this 6S battery. I'm going to try the other side. Okay, now I'm ch testing the other 6 cell battery, and that one is at 22.7 also. So I still had more flight time left before the ESC did burn up. So um, that's a good sign. Um, already I'm farther ahead than when I had um, built the giant quadcopter that I had, or the large quadcopter. Um, I think this thing probably could fly another maybe two or three more minutes at the max, so um, I won't know till later on. These ESCs, um, I'm going to have to do a little bit of research and locate ones that are about 120 to 150 amps, I think, before I fly it again. But it was a lot of fun to fly it. It's really heavy. I'm going to put it on the scale. I believe it weighs between 35 and 40 pounds. So I'm going to put it on the scale right now and we're, I'm going to do a quick weight. It's not a super accurate scale, but it'll give me a, a good idea of what the weight is total with the batteries on it. Because I haven't weighed it yet with the batteries on it, so I'm going to do that next. Now this is my testing scale I have. It's not real good. I just bought it at Tractor Supply. It just gives me an idea of what the weight might be. Um, it goes up to about 80 pounds. Uh, it looks almost kind of like it's for like a fish scale or something like that, but I'm going to go put the, the hex copter on with the batteries and I'm going to lift it up and then that'll give us an idea, at least a rough idea of what the total weight is on the copter. Okay, I've got the copter on the, the, the scale and I got to use two, two hands to hold this thing up. It weighs, uh, looks like it weighs about 38 to 39 pounds with all the batteries. You can see they're still on it. So this thing does have a lot of power. That's just about going to do it for this episode on the maiden flight launch for the giant hexcopter. So I hope you guys stay tuned in. Until next time, this is 3-1-Pockets, and thanks for watching.